Jonesy, another home game today against the Doyle. Uh, we were just talking with Doyle then and saying how much of a, a positive energy it was at the, off the game last week. Um, and it was a really good performance. Um, and it, you know, we, we wanted to sort of establish that today as well. 100%. You know, you definitely, I think we, we, we've got to uh, learn on, on learn from last week, haven't we? And also then progress on with that energy, as you've said already. Like, we've had a really good training week. And, I fully expect the lads to go and uh, go to go again in, yeah. uh, and, and take it on to another level. Really, that's that's the plan. Um, we should see whether that happens. Or not. The only obviously negative was obviously Simo got a, you know, another injury. If you know, really tough time for him now. How, how's he sort of coping with that? Um, remarkably well, all things considered. You know, I've been, been in touch with him a fair amount. Not yet visited him at home. He didn't, wouldn't, wouldn't allow me in the house uh, this week. So hopefully, I'll go and see him. I'll go and see him uh, next week. So he's doing all right. You know, it's a. Uh, it's a, it's a broken leg, you know, it'll, it'll take what it takes to heal. But, um, you know, he's he's had the experience of a, mm. a significant injury previously, hasn't it? So all those experiences will stand him in good stead. And he knows that we're here to support him and help him back. And, and hopefully he gets back in a, in a shirt soon. We were just saying to Doyle off the back of, obviously, the Simo's news that although, you know, things like that happen, the squads, you know, people coming in with the you know getting a shirt and they're really trying to keep it and I think that was a really sort of important thing last week that the subs made a really big impact so it's yeah, really yeah. feel like a really tight-knit squad and they can all I hope so yeah you know and, and, and some of those subs are going to get a chance to start today because of the impact they made yeah. and hopefully we can keep that energy going again so yeah 100% like everyone has to earn the right to wear the shirt and then when they've got it they've got to earn the right to keep it and you know there's a group of 11 that are going to start today and it's their their shirt for today and you know they've got to demonstrate that it should be theirs next week as well and then when the subbies come on and the, all the finishers come on you know that's their opportunity to show that they should be um considered for for a start next week so yeah we've got a really good squad um it was it was with simo being injured and a, and a couple of other people not available it's been an interesting selection for me this week uh, especially to make sure we're in a really good place to, to trouble Earlham um, and, and build on that energy that you said right at the beginning from last week yeah. so um, I, I think I think I've got that right I hope and then you know we'll see how the lads go today and, and hopefully we put in another really big shift and, and a good performance and come away with some points and just finally I think obviously Kendall struggled to get home last week and that must be really pleasing to see how like you know the community got behind that and you know looked after them and yeah I mean it's it's part of what what makes our island special isn't it like that that close community is it can be a super strength it can be a, a weakness at times as well it's not always amazing but um i think this week certainly all the supporters of the club and everyone associated with the club did themselves proud with how they've helped helped the club out and um i know it's really appreciated by kendall and i think everyone's looking forward to that that trip yeah. in a few weeks time to go and see them all again and hopefully we get home a little bit quicker than they got home good luck and all the best today cheers mate